Hey guys, welcome to another Axiom Aviation Short. In this video I want to explain a very simple VOR trick that will help us to understand what VORs are really telling us. So first off, what does VOR stand for? VOR stands for VHF, Omnidirectional Range, or Very High Frequency, Omnidirectional Range. Whenever I tell students this, they'll ask, okay, what does that mean? It means that a VOR is a ground-based navigational system utilizing very high frequency radio waves to provide information to pilots in flight. So what kind of information does it provide? It provides pilots with 360 degrees of navigation coverage. This navigation coverage is used to keep aircraft away from terrain, away from other aircraft, and to make it so that pilots don't get lost when they are flying to unfamiliar areas. Really, VORs are essential to the United States airspace system, so it is important that we understand the information that they are conveying. However, new pilots are often confused by VORs when they can't grasp the concept of how they work. They need to understand what their VOR indicator is telling them. This very simple trick has helped me and many of my students, so I have decided to share it. The trick is to think that the instruments on the VOR indicator are telling you where you are not. <clears throat> Let me explain. Here's our VOR indicator. We're going to use the CDI needle, the Course Deflection Indicator Needle, and the To From Indicator to help us to determine where we are in relation to the VOR. Using these instruments, all we have to do is cover up the CDI needle and the To From Indicator. In this example, we see that the VOR needle is deflected to the left or to the northeast and that we have a from indication. So very simply, we would cover up the left half of the VOR indicator because that's where the CDI is and we would cover up the bottom half of the VOR indicator because the from arrow is highlighted. Then the part that isn't covered tells us where we are in relation to the VOR. In this example, we would be southwest of the VOR. Now this makes VORs very useful because our VOR indicators always know exactly where we are. So there's no more getting confused. This trick works every time. It works on your written tests, it works in flight, and it will work on your check ride. To see more tips and tricks like this one, uh, you can join our private pilot webinar ground schools. Our webinar classes are personalized uh, to each of our students' needs. They are taught in easy to understand language with a live instructor, not taught by a pre-recorded video. Uh, so this way you can get all of your questions answered. The classes will also fully prepare you to pass your FAA written exam and the oral portion of your FAA checkride examination. So for pricing and date and time information, you can go to www.flyaxiom.com. Thanks again for watching, guys. Happy flying.